So what did you think when you first heard about this? I thought it was wonderful. I, I thought the cast was amazing. I, I was so thrilled to be a part of such an amazing group of actors. Um, I thought it was really clever to do the nativity story from the viewpoint of the animals because you can have some fun with that, with that without being disrespectful to the story. I actually really loved the palace dogs. I, I, I just was surprised at like, oh, look at this sort of element of danger and this kind of thrilling um, aspect to this story, which to me was really unexpected. So the kids will be entertained. It's funny enough for the adults and grandparents to appreciate it. I couldn't help thinking when I'm watching this that a lot of people are going to fall in love with Mary in a way they didn't because she's really the center of the story. Well, and I think, you know, they are sort of able to contemporize this ancient story without having to do something strange. They've, they've really made Mary and Joseph very human. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, we, we have our crushes with the statues and whatever, um, but this really brings it home and, and really reminds you of who they were and the, the, the faith and the trust that they had to have to go on this journey. What is, what is Edith in all of this? What does she Edith think of? Edith is just she's, like she's, me. Kind of, she's pretty chill. She's very chill. She's exhausted, like, every, like me and every other mother that I know. And um, she's just having to tolerate the nonsense going on around her. And I think she's a little bit jaded because, you know, she's kind of seen it all, um, which is really fun to, um, to play that when you know what's coming. And uh, it was, you know, I, 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 I just loved kind of inflecting a little bit of my Cleveland accent into her. Um, and I think it really worked well for her. So it was a lot of fun. It's been a really hard year. So this year in particular, what does Christmas mean to you? I think it's um, always to, you know, sort of take a break from the madness, although Christmas can kind of have its own type of madness when, you're, when your kids are little and you're trying to get all that done. Thankfully, we're empty nesters now, so Christmas really is about everyone just coming home and being together. Do you have a favorite carol? I love, I love Silent Night for the, the calm one, and I love Joy to the World for that big finish. Can't go wrong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you.